The Mississippi Blues Marathon is around the corner, and most runners have been training for months to get ready for the event. 16 WAPT race analyst Jeremy Jungling says he's been training runners to get them ready for the grueling conditions. Um, it's a challenging course. It's hills, and the, the interesting thing is if you run long enough, you start to notice the different types of hills. There's some long, slow, flat ones, some that just slowly incline, and then there's some rolling hills that really are challenging. And as you run through the different neighborhoods, um, you experience some of those different types of hills. And with the race being in late January, weather in Mississippi during that time is unpredictable. Jungling says after all the training on race day, most runners are looking to just finish what they started. And through all the training they've done, they've suffered through the conditions. They've battled cold, they've battled wind, they've battled rain. It's kind of toughened them up. So on race day, when it's a bad, you know, bad weather, bad conditions, um, most people don't mind. And frankly, when it's colder out, runners enjoy it more. And with music, food, and a great backdrop for the capital city, the Blues Marathon is more than just a race. You know, the, the Blues for over a decade now has really been the kind of a showcase for the, for the state of Mississippi. And along the course, you'll see a lot of the great, you'll have a lot of great music, you'll have a lot of great food. Um, so I think, the, I think the Blues is just a really neat destination marathon to really show people outside of the state what Jackson has to offer and what the state of Mississippi really has to offer. The Mississippi Blues Marathon will be held Saturday, January 26th. Marcus Hunter, 16 WAPT News.